New Mexico. If you want to vote, first you need to register to vote. If you're not sure whether you're registered already, there's a link in the description where you can check right now. So what if you're not registered or you need to update your name or address on your registration? In New Mexico, you can register in person, either at your county clerk's office, the DMV, or a public assistance office, or you can call your county clerk and ask them to mail you a copy of the registration form. Can you go on the internet and print it out? No, you have to call and have them mail it to you. You have until October 11th to get registered, and when you go, you'll be asked to show a current photo ID, as well as a current utility bill, bank statement, paycheck, student ID, or tribal ID that shows your name and address. There's a link in the description for where you can go to find your clerk's office. I suggest you go look it up and make a plan for when you're gonna register now, because you need to vote so that it can get easier to vote in your state. You have one of the harder states to vote in. Sorry to tell you that. Okay, so now for the fun part. You get to vote, because you're registered. If you'd rather vote for the comfort of your own home, you should request an absentee ballot. Any registered New Mexico voter can do it. You don't actually have to be absent on election day to vote by mail. All you have to do is fill out the form in the description and mail it to your county clerk by November 4th, though the sooner you do it, the better. Then you just wait for your ballot to show up in the mail, fill it out at your own pace, and send it back or drop it off at your clerk's office by November 8th. You can also vote early in person at your county clerk's office between October 11th and November 5th. There's a link in the description where you can and find early voting hours and locations near you if you want to skip the election day lines. If you want to vote in person on November 8th, though, you can look up where you need to go to vote using the link below. Polls are open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., and you won't need to bring an ID with you as long as you provided one when you registered. You should, however, think about bringing a sample ballot. You can find yours using the link in the description, and it'll tell you everything you'll be able to vote for. You don't have to vote for every single item on the ballot. You can leave things blank if you want to, but your local elections can be very important, so it's worth checking out what's on there ahead of time. You can even print out a sample ballot and bring it to the polls with you so you won't forget how you wanted to vote. All the links you need to check your registration, vote early, and find your polling location are in the description. Thank you for voting.